I'll be right back. I gotta go find someone. We're on a journey. I found him. My bus here. Working really hard. Lucas has some Yelp reviews that he wants to read to you guys. Let's do it. I've been waiting for this moment forever. Okay, so Alex is in another room. Alex, Alex didn't really know me that well, but she still really came through to me in, in a really impactful way. And I'll explain right now. So, we had this little accidental viral video that went out because a group of us actors were talking about our worst auditions. I happened to have my own camera, and I thought I would send this like, funny little thing on Instagram to just show people they're not alone right now. And I just thought it was funny, and then it kind of blew up and turned into this crazy thing. And I kind of freaked out because I think as actors, you expect like, oh, they want attention, they want like exposure but like you you know when you're getting exposure when you have like something coming out you have premiere dates you don't expect like a video to when go viral you start your own youtube channel exactly he had this viral video um it was purely accidental in this weird world that we live in and he's more than just a viral video he's so much more than that. he's so much more than that as you guys saw earlier he's also a shirtless hot guy in a hot tub oh. an actor Loves dogs? Loves dogs. What else? Loves to travel. Loves, loves to travel. Um, loves reading. Loves, um... Books. Loves cut off tees. I don't know. I'm, uh, all I'm saying is Lucas is a well-rounded person of many, and he's wonderful in this show. Thank you. She truly doesn't know how to be a, a, a liar. She's so honest. <laughs> This the whole thing do. is that there's more to Lucas than the viral videos. Yes. I think Yelp is he so funny. He loves Yelp. Let's start with the LA County Jail where there was a complete mix up. I was not supposed to be there. It was a complete accident. We're not going to get into why Lucas was in the LA County Jail. <laughs> well, we're not saying he even was. All yes. we're saying is that he wrote a Yelp review for the LA County Jail. One star. Treated like a junkyard cat in a cage. I was not only rudely shut down after hitting on several of the officers while intoxicated and incarcerated, but I was denied food for over 12 hours because I told them I was vegan when offered the freckled salami. My body was shaking like milk against the frigid cold concrete grounds throughout the thick of the night. I was tortured for my moon being in Virgo by the other inmates. Let me reiterate, this is not a place you want to get locked up and have a communal vibe. Better luck in San Bernardino. Unfortunately, my daughter was electrocuted when she spilled her hot chocolate in the electrical outlets and hence, this little cafe has outlawed all electronic devices. Better luck at Starbucks. Feels like that never happened. Do you have a daughter? What's I don't this? have a daughter. I don't have a kid. I'm not even married. Bunch of math. This one is for Rasselbog, which I've never even been to. I was having a horrible, horrible breakup, and all I wanted was a little bit of bratwurst to make it better. What I got instead was moral support and guidance in a relationship issue that my therapist couldn't crack for years. Two stars. My ankle got locked in, and I fell off a bike to a Rascal flat song. Two nightmares for the price of one. David Beckham's son, Brooklyn, shoulder checked me after class. I think it was an accident though. So it's why I am giving it two stars instead of one. It was an accident. One star. Without getting into too much detail about the activities that I engaged in the night before, the only thing I can legally post is that I needed water and I needed it fast. I have never supported a fast food organization politically, fiscally, or otherwise. Six letters, six plus seven plus six equals 19. COVID-19. Lucas, this is deranged. This is Two stars. Stay away. I wish I had. Throughout the night, I tossed and turned. A little girl died here. Her name was Tabitha. She bugged me incessantly through the night, and not a wink of sleep was had. But I'm sure she wanders. Better luck sleeping in hell. Yummy complimentary breakfast, though. Two stars. Was there a ha was there a ghost? There was a ghost, I think. What do you mean, this girl Tabitha? Okay, there was too. no ghost at all. We want to talk about how nice you are to birds. But. You don't need to be in the YouTube video. It's, it's no, it's great. No, it's not. It's not live or anything. I I edit them together. Oh, I say so. Yeah.
Yes, please. Come you here. can say something about Bridge, but you have to agree to be in the YouTube video. Are you comfortable with that? Okay, great. It's very important that you don't chew gum and spit it out. That you throw it in the trash and you wrap it up in paper. Because birds think it's food and they get it in their beaks. They get it in their beak. And then. PSA. Yes. John loves birds. I love all animals. Yes, me too. But loves all, loving, all, all living things. Yes. So don't spit out gum. Just don't do it. Yeah, just throw it into a napkin and then throw it away. That's right. Bye. Thank you, John. Yeah. Let me tell you something about John. <laughs> He's obsessed with birds. So I did a review about a mortuary. This reporter reached out from Yelp saying, Hi, I'm a reporter doing a piece for radio. I would love to speak with you about your experience at the mortuary that you reviewed. Please get back to me ASAP. What kind of life are you living over there in LA? What's going on with you? I need to get out of there. I think I'm <laughs> losing my mind. What's happening? I like to be quite boring. Um, Although you end up in the LA County Jail, so it can't be that boring. I never ended up in the LA County Jail. Uh, yeah. We, I want to ask you something. Okay. You can put this in your calendar, we can cut out. About, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, eat your food, eat your food. No, 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 I, no do okay, it. Go ahead. What made you want to do this channel? Was it to have Quarantine something? boredom. Really? Oh, yeah. And you wanted to, like, do something creative? And just... Me and, and Kate and Morgan, who are usually on the channel, we were bored during yeah. quarantine, and we, we wanted to do something creative. Yeah. I love that. Yeah. I love that. Yeah, we were just bored. I'm more starstruck by YouTubers than I am by actors. Like, our... Well, that's because you're 25. Okay. But our girl that we love... Jesus. Hey, Jesus. Jesus. How are you feeling today? I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah? Yeah. Um, I got you've been rest. up since you were up at 4. 4 a.m. Right. I was up at around there. I'm not going to get into the details of what happened this morning. Oh. <laughs> I must be on the internet opening. Look what Crafty gave me. They love me. <laughs> How, how fast can you get all 16? <laughs> hostess Mutt Bang. Don't get Jake, he doesn't want to. Ooh, I could be a Hostess Mutt Bang. Yeah. Uh -huh. Is that how you're going to eat this? Nibbles? <laughs> you're going to nibble your way through 16 <laughs> individual little bad spectacles? <laughs> 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 uh, uh, so can I have one? Can I have one? So what we typically see this time of year is you'll see a mom and a cat, which I think this is, and then there'll be a male escort whale that's hanging out with them, kind of keep an eye on them. Uh, the male's not the father, he's just showing off what a good father he is. The cat, that's a pretty good one. Oh, that's a good one.